nor gate as universal building block in the previous video we saw how different kind of logical operations can be performed using nand gate now here in this video we will see how nor gate can be used to construct different logic gates the nor gate is or gate followed with not gate the symbolic representation of nor gate is or gate followed with a not gate and here will be the output the two inputs are a and b and the output obtained is going to be a plus b the whole bar so using this expression different kinds of logic gate will be constructed first of all we will construct the not gate or the inverter gate using nor for that i will use one nor gate and we will supply it with the same input that is a so the output will be y is equal to a plus a the whole bar since this is how the nor gate works it gives us the sum and the complement of the inputs that's why we were getting y is equal to a plus b the whole bar here so in this case i will get y is equal to a plus a the whole bar now this a plus a can be written y is equal to a bar therefore y the output obtained is y is equal to a bar so whenever you will supply the same input to the nor gate it will act as not gate now we will construct the second logic gate and that gate is going to be or gate the boolean expression for or gate is y is equal to a plus b so we need to find this expression using nor gate we'll take the nor gate first the two inputs are going to be a and b and the output obtained here is going to be y is equal to a plus b the whole bar okay now we will simply invert this input that is we will pass it through the nor gate and again same inputs are provided to both the terminal so it will act like a not gate and thus the output is going to be a plus b bar over bar and therefore y is equal to a plus b thus this expression is obtained using nor gate now the third kind of logic gate is going to be and gate and the boolean expression for and gate is y is equal to a dot b okay so here we'll take a nor gate and we will provide same input to both the terminals that is a and the output obtained will be a bar again we will take one more nor gate here the input will be b and the output obtained will be b bar next a bar and b bar will be supplied to another nor gate and the output that will be obtained here is going to be a bar plus b bar the whole bar okay so this can be written as a double bar dot b double bar and this is equal to a dot b so y is equal to a dot b this is how and gate is constructed using three nor gates next and the last gate that we will be constructing will be the nand gate constructing nand gate we require and gate followed with not gate okay so i am going to use the same circuit as i used for and gate and i am simply going to add an inverter gate here so that i will get the nand gate so we will take a nor gate input is a output will be a bar another nor gate same input thus the output is going to be b bar 
and then we will supply it to the next NOR gate and here the output of 10 is going to be A dot B as you can see this entire circuit is used for NAND gate so now after this that is this whole setup is AND gate we need a NOT gate and, and we can't use this NOT gate so we will use another NOR gate with the same input and that will invert the input and we will get the output as y is equal to a dot b bar so in this way NAND gate is constructed using NOR gate this was all about the NOR gate as universal building block I hope the concept was clear thank you so much for watching till the end